All right, guys, it is 8.19 p.m., September 18th, 2017, Eastern Standard Time. Guys, this thing wasted no time. We are at Category 5, Hurricane Maria, 160 mile an hour sustained winds. We got a crazy eyewall uh, developing here. We have our big donut of high, high winds that are really hitting Guadalupe and areas like Dominica right now. Um, we have a, a long way to go with this storm, guys. This thing is going to get stronger and stronger. These are those storms that you see hit those 200 mile an hour winds. Do not be surprised if you see that. This, the way this storm's path is projected, it has nothing in its way, except for maybe Puerto Rico and parts of Santa Domingo, which would clearly be devastating for those places. I'm sure they already know the danger that they could possibly be in right now, especially Puerto Rico and all these islands here, guys. This is a devastating storm. These storms that form quickly and get strong this fast, they are just very powerful very high winds and when we see raises in strength like this this is again when you see those storms that hit those 200 mile an hour winds and all we have left to go is warm water no shear winds we have nothing to put in front of this storm to weaken it unless like I said it touches these islands but guys this thing is so big this may not do much right now it took a long part of the coast of Cuba to weaken Irma before it went up the west coast of Florida and guys this storm is gonna be bigger than Irma um, I'm pretty much sure of that at this point. This is going to be possibly the strongest storm we have this season. Um, it's just, I, I don't know how we can get any bigger and powerful than this, at least this quick, um, past the peak of hurricane season. We do have until the 30th, so who knows at this rate. But guys, this storm, I don't think I've ever seen a storm develop this quick. We're talking 20, 24 hours, give or take an hour, between this thing being a tropical storm and a Cat 5. We were dealing with 50 mile per hour winds um, around 1 or 2 a.m. Sunday. And we are at 821 Monday, guys, just to give you an idea of how quick this thing grew. Uh, here are those numbers for you. The 17th, 2100 GMT time uh, is when we turned to Hurricane. So it was 18, 19, 20, so about 2059 GMT time. We were Tropical Storm. And now just about 26 hours later, September 18th, we are at 160 mile per hour sustained winds. And there's that pressure I was talking about, that it could possibly reach 926, 922 if it does wrap up the East Coast. So guys, just a quick update. This is a very serious storm. This thing's going to do a lot of damage to these places, uh, far worse than we thought even just eight hours ago. All right, guys, so think about these people. If you know anyone in these areas, let them know if, the, if there's still even time at this point. Um... Not good news, guys. We just got to wait and see what happens uh, with this storm and the East Coast and what paths it takes. But, again, there's not much in the way of this thing to stop it um, except for time. And that's all we can do right now is keep an eye on it. All right, guys, I'll bring you any major updates that come my way. Thank you so much. I'll talk to you soon.